Good morning. I'm Mrs. Parent from Beersley Library. We just read a great story about Russell the sheep who had a problem getting to sleep. And if you watch that video, see how he solved that problem. So today we're going to make a very easy sheep mask that only involves a few things because you are going to be the face to this mask. Here's one that I already put together. Ba -a 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 -a. Hello. So we've got a, all we need is a paper plate that you just cut out the middle to it so that you can put, um, you, you can put cotton balls, all the glue cotton balls all the way around. This sheep mask that I made had little white ears. I'm going to make some that are black this time because some sheep have black ears, but you can do whatever color you want. So we need that. We need the paper plate. We need the cut, the black for the ears. We need a lot of cotton balls. I need white glue, any kind of white glue. And also, if you want, you can use um, just to, to glue his ears on the back. But then I think we're going to tape them down, too, so they'll be more secure. So a glue stick and this, a little bit of tape. If, and if you have scissors to cut yourself or cut to cut all the pieces out yourself, and if you want to trace them first, then you'll need a pencil. So let's get started. I'll angle this down so you can see what I'm doing. Here is our, our first piece is the uh, plate that I cut the center out. So you can have someone help you with that because it is a little bit tricky to get that little circle out of the center out of it because that's where your face is going to go. So we will start by cutting out his ears so we can put ears on the side. You can see the ears on a sheep go right straight out the side, not up the top like of some puppy dogs, but it goes straight out the side. So you see the shape of those? It's kind of a little bit of a teardrop at an angle. So that's what we're gonna do with this um, double piece of black construction paper. We're gonna cut out two at the same time so you can either fold a piece of construction paper in half, black construction paper in half, so that way you'll have two ears that are the same size. So here we go. So it's kind of a teardrop uh, shape, but it's a, it's a ear shape for a sheep for sure. So we'll cut out our own and make our own little sheep mask to see if we can fall asleep counting sheep. So here's two ears. So we could turn this over because um, we're going to put one on one side and one on the other side like that. So we'll turn it over and, t and just tape these down. Like I said, it kind of goes, they kind of go straight out the side like they were on this little guy here. And if you put a little bit of glue on them first, that will help them to stick better. And then the tape on top of it will really secure them well. So here is one ear that's going to be sticking out. And here's another ear that's going to be sticking straight out. A little floppy-eared uh, sheep. So then this tape we'll put on it will help adhere it to your mask so then it won't fall off. So we got one side we taped on and then we're going to tape on this other side and really push it down. All right. So now you're going to take your white glue and open it up and just put swirls of glue all around it so that the cotton balls will stick. You don't need a lot. I'm just kind of wiggling it around here in little swirls. And then maybe all the way around like that. All right. This is the fun part. We get all our cotton balls. Here they are. And start placing them all the way around our little sheep mask. Here we go. So we can be pretend to be a sheep just like poor little Russell who couldn't sleep.
Now, if you don't happen to have cotton balls, you can also just cut out some strips of white or strips of black construction paper and glue them all around to make a fuzzy little sheep. But it's fun to have the cotton balls. And it goes on fast and this craft is done so quickly. Look at that. If you find extra spots to fill in and then you want to press them down a little bit. And we have a different Russell the Sheep. Well, look at him with the little black ears. So I'll just angle this back up so you can see what I look like as Russell the Sheep with little black ears. So here we go. Wasn't that fast and quick? And now you have your own sheep mask to play with. And if you made one with the white ears, you can have a friend to play with you too. That is great. So thank you for joining us for this simple craft with a, it's a lot of fun and soft and fuzzy. And I hope you have a great week. I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.